While it may seem intimidating at first, learning how to make a bow is very easy. I'm Megan Carter and this is Ask the Decorator. Bows are the perfect finishing touches for gift baskets, wreaths, flowers, just about anything. But before you can add them, you need to know how to make a bow. To make a bow, all you will need is a long ribbon and some wire. Before you do anything, cut a piece of craft wire that is three inches long and set it aside. It will be used to wire the ribbon together later. Then, get a very long piece of ribbon. The ribbon can be thick or thin, whatever you prefer, and wired or unwired. But I prefer wired because it is much easier to work with. Once you have your ribbon, take it off the spool and straighten it out. You'll thank me for that later. After the ribbon has been straightened, pinch the ribbon, leaving a long tail. Next, make a loop with the ribbon. If your ribbon is not the same on each side, twist it. Then make another loop. After making each set of loops, put your pointer finger in one loop and your middle finger in another. And pull the loops together to see if they are the same length. If not, adjust them. Continue making loops in that manner until you think you have enough. For this bow, I will be making five loops on either side, so 10 loops in total. Now as for the center of the bow, you have two options. For a dressier bow, before you attach the wire to the bow after making the loops, make one last tiny loop. Then thread the wire through the last loop and around the ribbon. Spread the loops out and you're done. For a more casual bow, after making your loops, take the piece of wire you already cut and twist it around the center of the loops. Take the tail of the ribbon and wrap it around the bow and wire it down from the back. Then spread the loops out. After making the bow to your liking, cut the two tails off the bow by folding them together and making an angled cut with a scissors. If you would like to make a double bow, make the bottom layer just as I showed you but without a center. Then, take a different colored ribbon and start making the bow in the same way. Only this time, make each set of loops a bit shorter. Make the last loop very small for the center of the bow. Wire the bow together and spread the loops out. Cut the tails and attach the bow to the other bow you made with wire. Now, all you have to do is find a place for all of your beautiful bows. I'm Megan Carter and this is Ask the Decorator. For more decorating tips and information on new decorating products, visit my website, askthedecorator.com.